Crisis Negotiators. As within a review, this may contain spoilers. The movie was okay. The story takes place in Hong Kong and is set in the 1990s, I believe. A senior negotiator becomes the number one suspect in a murder case and is also accused of embezzling money. He feels he can't trust anyone and takes it upon himself to clear his name. The senior negotiator takes over the internal investigations office and holds four people hostage. He requests a former negotiator to be his negotiator as he feels that negotiator is an honest person. If you're familiar with negotiator films, then this won't surprise you in any way. Any misdirection, or attempt at a twist in the story was not successful, at least to me. All the typical beats of these types of movies were there with nothing original added besides the location and circumstances that led up to the main storyline. However, that's not to say that you still would enjoy the film. While it's not as creative as I would like the story to be, it's still a good, solid watch. At the beginning of the movie, it states that this is based on the novel The Negotiator. However, from what I've read, this is more of a remake of the 1998 American film The Negotiator, which I haven't seen. Also, I believe the story in the book is really different than both the Negotiator movies. One of the negatives for me is that the story was too predictable. That includes having convenient characters. One of the hostages knows how to hack files in a computer which helps provide evidence that the Negotiator needs. Since I didn't see the American version, and since this is a remake of the American version, I assume the American version was also predictable. What I would have liked to see was for the Negotiator to take the hostages as he did, but instead of asking for the former Negotiator to be there, he gets the former Negotiator negotiator to investigate and find the evidence. This provides a natural time plot device because he needs to gather the evidence before the police break into the building. So while the negotiator is holding the hostages and keeping the corrupt officials busy, the other negotiator is investigating in the background. Overall, the movie is okay and it may be worth watching. If you stuck around this long, why not give the video a like and subscribe? Also check out my other videos, leave a comment and let me know what you think of the film. See you in the next review.